Welcome back. The traditional pay by the hour fee model for attorneys is changing. Here to talk more about that, we have Aaron Garrett. He is with a uh, nonprofit, Legal Services of Utah, uh, also a partner with Utah State Bar. So great to have you with us. Thanks so much for being here. Absolutely. My pleasure. Okay, so we, we look at this model and it, we're talking about changes, but before we get into that, who are we directing this message for? Yeah, this message is for people who are caught in between those who qualify or don't qualify for free services and those who can't afford a full priced attorney. So the middle class group of Utahns who... Okay. And what type of challenges do you typically see them in without this model that we're about to talk about? The big problem is people trying to represent themselves in court or at least getting some kind of assistance from an attorney if you can't afford to retain someone to represent you for your whole case. Mm -hmm. And trying to represent yourself can lead to what potential consequences? Well, you could lose your case um, without even knowing it. Um, mm -hmm. You might not do something that you're supposed to do. There's lots of deadlines and lots of responsibilities in a case. Yeah, that's uh, why law school takes so long, right? <laughs> that's part of it, yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's talk about this new option uh, because obviously people make these decisions based on their finances and their income. So when we talk about a new model, what are some of the new options that people that you say that are kind of stuck in the middle may have to look forward to in the future. Absolutely. So the Utah State Bar has a program called LicensedLawyer.org. And if you go to that website, you can be connected to attorneys who have agreed to accept uh, lower fees, who have agreed to charge you based on your income and family size, and who have agreed to take cases different from the normal pay-by-the-hour uh, model. So maybe a flat fee for a particular service. Mm -hmm. So. When you take a look at these different options, how do you know which one might be best for you? What advice do you have for people on that? The website is really great because it will direct you to the different types of attorneys who can handle particular types of cases. Mm -hmm. um, another great option is a program called the Modest Means Program through the Utah State Bar as well. And that again will help you connect with an attorney who's agreed to take cases at significantly reduced prices and also offer free consultations. Yeah, let's get into that because uh, a lot of these cases will offer free consultations. How does that process work and how can that benefit the individual? So speaking with a lawyer, even if you can't afford one, is a great benefit. Um, and so if you can meet with an attorney for a half hour or an hour, either through the Modest Means program or through some of the other clinics that the bar or even the University of Utah Law School offers, it can really help you out understanding the process and what you're getting yourself into if you can't afford an attorney. So have you already seen people take advantage of these other type of payment options? Absolutely. These programs have been around for some time. We're trying mm -hmm. to get the word out so Got that it. those people who don't have an attorney can hopefully get one. And what type of experiences and outcomes are you starting to see with those that have taken advantage of it? It's, well, I probably sound like a broken record, but it's a lot better to have an attorney by your side than it is to do the case on mm -hmm. your own. Because chances are the, the other party will have an attorney and they'll know how to take advantage of the system Got it. and you won't be able to. All right, so legal services within reach for those in the middle. Again, where's that website and the best way to connect with you guys? LicensedLawyer.org. All right, we'll have that information on our website as well. Thanks so much for being here. I appreciate it. Thank you.